a huge musical theater fan, and I don't think this is a surprise for anyone who's literally ever had a conversation with me. I've never been to New York, but I do my best to try and consume as much theater content as absolutely possible. And one of my favorite ways to do this, besides Broadway cast albums, hello dear Evan Hansen, is theater podcasts. I had recommended a podcast episode to one of my castmates from American Idiot today, and he mentioned that he actually had no idea theater podcasts existed until I mentioned them. So I'm going to talk about three of my favorite theater podcasts and hopefully introduce some of you to this magical world. Half Hour Call is actually the first one I ever listened to, and it's still one of my favorites. It's hosted by a performer named Chris King, and the episodes are only 30 minutes long, so they're fairly short. Chris has been in a couple Broadway shows as well as some tours. I really like this podcast because he goes into depth about what the journey to performing has been, and then what the daily routines of the people in the industry are. As someone who really enjoys performing, I find it so, so cool to find out what the people who do this for a living are actually doing every day. Right now he has 29 episodes, but the one I definitely recommend you start with is episode 4. It's with James Monroe Iglehart, and he is probably one of my favorite Broadway performers. They go behind the scenes of Tony Day, and I knew nothing about how the Tonys worked before this episode, and it was really, really interesting to see how it worked. Broadway Backstory is another really, really cool one, especially if you like seeing behind the scenes of how a show gets put together. Patrick Hines hosts this show, and he also hosts Theatre People podcast, as well as Broadway Con the podcast. He is an amazing host. He is literally just like a huge Broadway nerd and so he gets so excited and so passionate in like every interview. The Broadway Backstory podcast is newer so it's only I think seven episodes right now. Each podcast episode takes a different show and documents how it went from an idea all the way through to being on the Broadway stage. My favorite episode is actually a two-part episode about In the Heights. I've never seen In the Heights and I actually know very little about the music but they have some crazy stories about how they got this whole production up on Broadway and how it became a huge Broadway hit. Also, Lin-Manuel Miranda is a genius, and I will literally listen to any and every interview that he does. Arguably, my favorite podcast is called Broad Wasted. It's hosted by three people, Brian, Kevin, and Kimberly. The whole premise of this podcast is that they sit down with a Broadway star or somebody in the industry, get drunk, and play Broadway-themed games. This podcast is the perfect balance of feeling like you're hanging out with the guests on the podcast, but also like you're getting a lot of information out of this interview. It is so, so, so entertaining. And because there's alcohol involved, they end up being a little bit less formal than some of the other podcasts I've mentioned, but it makes for a great listening experience. It was so hard for me to pick a favorite episode, but I think it would have to be Andrew Keenan Bolger or Jeremy Jordan, who both happen to have been in the show Newsies, which I'm obsessed with, but also are both really talented performers. Those are my top recommendations for Broadway podcasts, but there are so many more out there to discover. I'm always looking for more podcasts to listen to, so if you happen to be part of this weird niche Broadway theater podcast community, please let me know what you recommend if I haven't already recommended your favorites. If you actually end up listening to these podcasts and you find one that you really like, please feel free to talk to me about it. I am always down to talk about Broadway podcasts or Broadway. Hope you enjoyed my recommendations and happy listening!